Thank you for joining us this evening. I'm Kimberly Hunt. My co-anchor Wally Aliou is off tonight. It's the latest development in a story that Team 10 has been following from the beginning. This evening, investigative reporter Austin Grabish shows us what the medical board says the physician did wrong. Elisa Serna's final moments in county jail were captured on video difficult to watch. She was pregnant and going through heroin and alcohol withdrawal. Two major red flags the medical board says a jailhouse doctor should have clued into. The board says Dr. Frederike von Lintek failed to take care of Serna properly. The young mother had been booked into jail for shoplifting alcohol. Von Lintek incorrectly wrote in Serna's chart she had finished treatment for withdrawal. Serna complained she was having fainting spells, but von Lintek wrote staff thought she had been faking it. The doctor never sent Serna to the ER for treatment of substance withdrawal during pregnancy. After evaluating her, she watched the 24-year-old on a video monitor remotely. She was struggling with consciousness, bouncing against the walls, and at times falling to the ground. Later that night, it was too late. Serna was dead in her cell from complications with substance withdrawal during pregnancy. The DA criminally charged von Lintag in 2022 with involuntary manslaughter. Earlier this year, a jury acquitted her and a nurse who were in the jail cell that day. In July, Team 10 reported the county agreed to pay Serna's family $15 million. It's one of the largest settlements in San Diego County history. At the time, Serna's mom, Paloma, called out the deputies and medical staff who failed her daughter. It's a disgrace. Uh, where's the compassion? There's no love. I believe these people still need to be held accountable. Um, you know, there's lots for us to fight to get justice. And, you know, um, we're going to keep exhausting our avenues. This week, accountability from the medical board. Its order to have Dr. Von Lindhag's license surrendered comes into force this Friday. Attorneys for the physician did not return my request for comment. Austin Grabish, Team 10. Austin covers the Medical Board of California. He's one of our government watchdogs and also covers military investigations. If you have a story to share, you can email him or scan the QR code on your screen.